Howdy folks, I'm Eric Williams and welcome to CapeCast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times. What's the connection between Siobhan Magnus's tattoo and the Edward Gorey house in Yarmouth Port? Find out next! CapeCast! Last night Siobhan Magnus wowed America with her performance on American Idol. She sang a Rolling Stones song. Some say she's the favorite right now to win the whole enchilada. And most noticeable for Gory fans and other fans was her tattoo, an Edward Gory work. What do you know about this? I think it's fantastic. Uh, last night she sang the Stones' Paint It Black, and what more appropriate song or color for a, a Gory fan to use. Tell us about Edward Gory and the tattoo that we see on Siobhan Magnus's arm. Gory was an American uh, author and illustrator, lived on Cape Cod the last uh, 14, 15 years of his life here in Yarmouth Port. And the tattoo that you see on Siobhan is from the Gashley Crumb Tinies. The Gashley Crumb Tinies is probably Edward's most famous work. And it's a story, it's an alphabet of 26 kids that meet 26 very unfortunate demises, beginning from A is for Amy, who fell down the stairs, B is for Basil, assaulted by bears, all the way to Y is for York, whose head was knocked in, and Z is for Zilla, who drank too much gin. Siobhan told Shirley Halpern of the LA Times Idol Tracker blog that she grew up familiar with Gory's work because her mom was a huge Gory fan. And plus, we want to thank Shirley Halpern for giving us this really cool Siobhan tattoo photo. From what we understand, um, the inspiration for this tattoo may have come right from here because you guys carry the world famous Gashley Crumb Tiny's lunchbox. We do, and uh, in two different sizes. And we understand that the tattoo artist used the lunchbox as the inspiration for the tattoo. My word for a um, phrase for Gory is whimsically macabre. A lot of people would say his work is dark or macabre, but there's always an underlying sense of humor under it. Now, have you heard of other people getting a tattoo similar to this? We actually have a rogues gallery of photographs of people that come in during the season with uh, various gory tattoos. The younger generations uh, are new gory fans, and a lot of them uh, maybe in the goth world, and they kind of think of Edward as the patron saint of goth, though he certainly wasn't a goth himself. And, uh, but we have people coming in with tattoos of not only the Gashley Crumb Tinies, but some of the individual tinies themselves, uh, bats, fig bashes, the doubtful guest, all sorts of tattoos. We actually have a gory what? stamp. Oh, man. Oh, wow. So you have a stamp like this, so you come here and get a temporary gory tattoo just like Siobhan Magnus? Absolutely. Cape Cast.